Making moves, no time to lose, gotta show them what we all about Don't know about you, but I know about me, and boy, I got no Okay, first off, I really have to apologize to you guys for this video being late. Uh, but I do want to explain what happened. Uh, unfortunately, uh, when we were doing the team hangout, uh, people were having a problem hearing me because I wasn't using this headset. I was using my Bluetooth headset, and I guess it just didn't pick up as well. So I just did a 30-minute awesome freaking video, and I got ready to upload it, and I went to put my intro on the front, and guess what? The entire 30 minutes, no audio. Kind of sucks. So I'm redoing it, but this time I'm not going to free flow. I'm just going to cut it down to the important things. But what I wanted to talk to you about tonight, and I already have, but I'm going to do again because I messed up on it, um, is negativity. Yes, negativity. I wanted to share with you an experience that I've had. Uh, because I have been around a lot of negativity in my life, and I'm tired of it. I got sick of it earlier this year. Um, but I just wanted to share with you something that happened a few days ago. Um, my mom, see, because my, my wife, my son, myself, and my mother are all on one cell phone account. And she decided that she wants to uh, remove herself from our account. And the problem is, she just signed last month a brand new two-year contract on her line. So there's going to be an early termination fee if she does that. And that's what I had brought up to her, that I... <clears throat> you know, if because she already said she wanted to leave that company before, and I told her if you were going to leave that company, the time to do that was before you signed a two year contract. And she said, Well, I'll pay an extra forty dollars. Well, that's not going to do much for a two hundred and fifty dollar fee. Now, it's not the fee that's the big deal, it's that you know, take care of your own responsibilities because I got enough. You know, we have seven boys and three girls, and most of you know that, or if you don't, you do now. So, while money is not really important to me, the money that we make uh, for the reasons of supporting the family, uh, that is important to me. And, you know, she, she told me, well, why don't you just get a real job? And that really made me mad. Because, yeah, I work on the internet, but, you know, I, I, I've even told her before. I said... Guess what? I made $2,000. And what was her response? That won't last. It's a fluke. It's not going to happen again. You know, and... It, it just really got to me. And she told me, you know, you just need to find a real job. Well, I'm sorry, but I don't want a real job. Number one, my medical condition, uh, or actually several conditions that I have, don't allow me to do physical work anymore. And... You know, that's part of the reason I decided to become a stay-at-home dad. And the other part of the reason was that when I got fired from Walmart, when my wife and I got together, you know, I'm not going to go into the whole, all the reasons I was fired, but suffice it to say that I called in too much because there was too much stuff happening. You know, I'm the only one that drives between me and my wife, and that's by her choice. Uh, that's not something I imposed. And... When one of the kids would get sick or get hurt, they had to go to the hospital. Well, I called in too much. Uh, you know, and working at home, I make my own hours. If I need to call in, what do I do? Nothing. I don't have to call in to somebody. I don't have to worry about getting, writ getting written up. I don't have to worry about getting fired. I don't have to worry about, you know, is someone going to be mad at me? Are they going to cut my hours because of it? Or you know any of that stuff so when she told me to get a real job I was upset because she knows nothing about what I do you know and she knows she knows nothing about the business and I've you know she's asked me about it before and I spent two hours with her on the phone explaining the whole nine yards she says well I don't know if it'll really work I'll have to think about it well okay you keep on thinking about it I'm gonna keep doing it and making money but anyway um, those of you that know me well know that nine for the most part I don't cuss and there's you know for the kids for my beliefs you know that's 
whatever the reason, I don't really cuss much. But she actually had me so mad. Uh, I'll just tell you the story. I told her, you know, because she's disabled also, I said, you know, you should know better than anybody uh, what it's like to have conditions that keep you from working because she's got a bunch of problems with her back. <clears throat> and she said, well, I worked at that storage company for three years. And I told her, Mom, you were sitting behind a desk and driving a golf cart for three years. And she said, well, you'd have to do whatever it takes, even if you have to go out and push a lawnmower. And that's when I told her, you know, you, sit, you sat behind a desk and drove a golf cart for three years. Because literally, that's what she did. And her response was, well, I even had to go sweep out units on a cane. Because, you know, sometimes I have to be on a cane, and I mentioned that. You know, she said, well, I was on a cane, and I had to go sweep out units. And I even had to sweep the ceiling. And I told her, are you telling me that a broom was like an effing lawnmower? I mean, honestly, seriously? I mean, what's wrong with you? And she just kept going and going. And I told her, you know, if you send me even one more text message, that's it. I'm going to block you. Well, apparently she didn't believe me. So I ended up having to block her from my home phone, home phone and my cell phone. Uh, that's text message and calling. Now, do I regret that? No. I wish I would not have had to do it, but I don't regret it either. Because I've had enough negativity in my life. And it's like crabs in a bucket. That's a, an example I like to use a lot. Our financial situation is like the bucket. We're all crabs in the bottom of this bucket. And we're trying to pull our way out and climb our way out. Some of us are. But all our friends and the family and all the... Well, I'm not going to say friends and family specifically, but... You know, a lot of them are negative. They'll be the first ones to hand you the negativity. But all these negative people... What are they trying to do? They're trying to grab you and pull you back down. Either because they're trying to use you to climb out, or because they don't even want you to succeed because then they'll be alone. Well, sorry, ain't going to be me. So I ended up having to block my mom. And as I said, I don't regret it. Not one bit. Uh, I ended up unblocking her t today or today or yesterday. Um... But, you know, you have to do whatever it takes because nobody else is going to do it for you. You know, sometimes you will run across special people like Karin. I got into Internet Marketing and Empower Network and I had absolutely zero help. Zero. Okay. Yeah, your mindset does matter. But you can't concentrate only on your mindset because you still have to do the marketing. And that's what I had trouble with. I didn't even know where to start, what to do. Um, that's not to say I didn't try because I would work, you know, 16 to 20 hours a day for two months straight and didn't make a dime. You know, and this is a program that I was paying for. So I got to the point where I was ready to quit. And that's when I met Karin. And it was Karin that convinced me to keep going. And to not give up. Y'all have to excuse me. I'm kind of sick. but <clears throat> So that's what made me stick with this business. And actually try it. Because she said you know what. Don't quit Empower Network. Because then if you quit. You have to wait six months before you can get back in. She said. Get an instant payday network. Do this program. And I didn't even sign up under her. So I mean she had. Literally she had nothing to gain from it. But this is what made me notice her. And the kind of person that she was. And because it's the same kind of person I am. She said, get in this. Use the training here. Because it's free. And then you can take this in-depth training. That everybody, well that her and that you know other people when they, when they, what's the word, contribute to the training. You know, they're not charging you for it. They're not asking you anything for it. Like the training videos that I make. I mean, I don't do it very often, but I'm not asking anything for it either. The reason I do it is because I want to. I want to see other people succeed as well. You know, and she is the she is the one that kept me from quitting Empower Network, and that got me into into Instant Payday Network. And one thing I can say, no, I haven't been promoting Empower Network yet, because I'm still learning as much as I can. And when I feel like I'm ready to hit that hard, 
then trust me, I'm going to take off in Empower Network. But I've been making money in Instant Payday Network. Now, a lot of times I spend, I, I honestly, I'm just going to, I'm going to be honest with you. Most of my time is spent on team stuff, uh, bonuses that I provide free for my team and for my team only. And uh, one of those is a free autoresponder. Uh, it's one that I have put together. It's, you know, I'm the one that did the coding. I put it on my server. It's free. You can change the auto responses. You can send out email blasts. You know, and that's some of the things that that we can't do on the autoresponder that comes with the system for free. Well, I say for free, mine's free too, but the one that comes with the system, you can't do that with. You can't change the responses, the emails that people get. You can't type out an email and have it blasted out to your entire list whenever you want to, when you come across something great. You know, like, well, check this out. I found this, and it's... Uh, all about, uh, I don't know, um, Facebook graphic sizes. You know, for different, if you want to post a graphic or a picture on Facebook, you know, or do a banner ad or whatever, uh, you know, cover photo, it gives you all the, the size, pixels, how many, however many pixels high and wide and all that. You know, sometimes when I find stuff like that, I send it out to my list. Now, most of them have not joined me, but they're seeing that I that I give valuable content and that I share things that I learn. And you know, that that's the kind of people that you want to be around. You want to be around the kind of people that are want that want to help you succeed, that want to see you succeed for genuine reasons. <coughs> now, I'm going to tell you my reasons for wanting to see people succeed is because I hate to see people suffer. I hate it. You know, I I have a friend named Amanda, and she's a single mother with a two-year-old, and it breaks my heart because she doesn't have a running vehicle. She has to get a payday loan every other week to pay for gas so that she can get a ride to work, so that she can get her check, so that she can pay off her payday loan. And, you know, where she's living, it's it's... I don't want her living there. Now, I don't have any attachment to this lady other than friendship. And, you know, we're not even really that close. But it just, it kills me that she has to go through that, you know. Um, a couple of friends of mine, they're always constantly struggling. One of them actually joined Instant Payday Network, but he hasn't done anything. And I can feel bad for him all I want. But he has to do the work. I can't do it for him. He has to learn. And one day he was over at my house. You know, he brought his computer and um, we were doing some other things and, and, you know, playing Halo, playing games and stuff. And I had an idea and I thought, well, let me just do this to get it to, to get his attention. So what I did was I had already helped him build a capture page. And I still had that address in my bookmark. So I took his capture page and I promoted it to 10 groups. 10, that's it. He got two opt-ins. <clears throat> which tells me that his capture page works. And I thought, well, maybe if I do it, if I give him a kickstart and give him some encouragement, maybe that would help. And man, I can, he was so excited you would not believe. Oh, wow, I, you know, I got opt-ins. Where'd that come from? And blah, blah. And I told him I... I posted your link in 10 groups on Facebook. It took me about five minutes. That's because that's before I really learned how to do it real fast. And he was like, are you serious? You were promoting my link? And I told I mean, because it's the truth. I want other people to succeed. I hate seeing other people struggle because I've been struggling. I have I struggled for such a long time financially. And I know what it's like. And I don't want other people to be there. I know what it's like to not have help. I don't want other people to end up without help. You know, and, you know, these other programs, a lot of, well, I can't say all of them because that's not true, but a lot of these other programs, you okay, you get the system for free. But if you want to learn how to do it, you've got to pay 100 bucks, 200 bucks, $500. You know, what, who's to say that we can't all make money? 
What's wrong with that? Because any, say this is the level of my need. This is what I need up to here to pay my bills and to get everything taken care of. And I make this much. So the difference between here and here, that's not mine. That's for me to use to help other people. Now, a lot of money I've been putting back into my business. I've been putting it in for hosting. I've been putting it in for, uh, you know, people to help with things here and there. Uh, as far as my, my team tools go and my bonuses. And, you know, I haven't been promoting as much as, as I want to. So I haven't made as much as I should be making right now. Uh, and again, it's, you know, it's just like Karin. Because always helping other people and doing things for other people. And that's great. But... You have to make sure that you take care of yourself. Because if you can't take care of yourself, you can't take care of, take care of other people. I'm not saying that you should be, uh, you know, I'm not saying that you shouldn't help people. But if you're not making any money, then you can't help other people like this girl, Amanda. I want to be able to make an extra $1,000. So I can take that $1,000, I can go to Time Warner, and I can say, here, I want to pay a deposit and three months worth of cable, internet, at this address. And then from there on, she can take over the, the payments. And then I want to go to Walmart and buy her one of those little $300 laptops that will work just fine for this business and give it to her. So that I can give her the free training and show her how to do it. So that she doesn't have to get a payday loan every other week just to pay for gas so she can have a ride so she can get a check to pay off that payday loan and you know I've I've been in that situation before well I haven't done payday loans but I've been in this in a position where I have to borrow before every paycheck and then have to pay that back before every single paycheck I had to borrow and then pay back borrow and then pay back and you know while you have friends and family that don't mind you doing that I didn't like it you know, there, okay, there's no way that I could describe to you in words how I feel about it. And I know you've heard me say it so many times, but this is a free system. It's absolutely free. It doesn't cost you anything. So what's the worst that you have to lose? Honestly, what's the worst that you have to lose? You're not spending any money on it. You know, it, if you spend a couple hours a day on the computer anyway, why not take half of that and use it to, to promote and, you know, using free methods that still don't cost you anything so that you can make some money. An absolute worst that can happen if you don't put any effort in is you still haven't lost anything. Right? But what's the, let's say you do start making money. Let's say you, you get, good at it, get good at it real quick. You go through the training. You remain teachable. You learn the lessons. You ask for help when you need it because we're all here to give it to you. And there's 6,200 people in our group. So it's not like you don't have anywhere to turn for help. And let's say you do start doing that. And you start making $2,000 a month extra. So take 150 of that and put it into Empower Network every month. Take another $25 of that and put it in uh, I don't, Infinity Downline every month. And use the same method you learn in Instant Payday Network to promote these other ones. Because we teach it, we teach it all to you for free. And that's, that's what, it really bugs me when people say, this is not working. I don't understand this, blah, 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 blah. And I ask them. Well, where are you at in the video tutorials? What video tutorials? The ones I told you about. Oh, I haven't done that yet. But they want to ask me for help. They want me to spend three hours on Facebook chat explaining stuff to them with just typing rather than going and watching a seven minute video or, or a 13 minute video or even a 30 minute video that shows you step by step how to do it. And that's what kills me. And that's the people, those are the people that I do not even help anymore now as you all know um, I have asked and Karin has asked uh, not to private message us in the support group or from the support group for support messages 
because like I said there's 6,200 people in there right now and there's plenty of people to help you 24 7 uh, not to say that we don't want to help you because a lot of times we are the ones still helping you in the group but my point is do what it takes do what it takes to change your life do what it takes to change your situation and if it takes watching a video watch that video and if you don't understand it watch it again and if you still don't understand it ask us a question about what you don't understand ask it in the group because anybody will help you with it There's a whole bunch of people will help you with it with anything that you need so there's no excuse it's a free system we teach you free marketing the teaching is free the help the support group is free if you join my team the autoresponder is free the team rotator is free on your birthday we're gonna promote your link all of us for you to make money because that's the best <laughs> that's the best thing we can give you for your birthday is we all promote your link for a day you know and I just there are so many advantages and I haven't really found a disadvantage yet the only disadvantage that I've found is sometimes my rear end gets sore because I have so much fun <laughs> doing this business and promoting and making videos and all these other things that I sit in this this office chair sorry my jacket's on it this is my chair and it's a nice it's a nice chair it really is but when you sit in it for 12 hours even if you're getting up and doing other things in the meantime sometimes you know you, you got to get up and walk around you got to get up and do something else exercise whatever and is this is this business a slave driver no but I have fun doing it you know and it, like the videos the video I'm making right now uh, you can probably tell I'm not nervous at all I used to be I tell you what the the very first video I made it was like 18 hours of video clips and I did it over and over and cut this out and add that and redo this and you know re-record this part of the video and sl splice it in and do you know that video never got posted never because I was never happy with it and now if I make a mistake if there's kids making noise in the background if the dog jumps up on my lap if one of the kids starts waving their hand in front of the camera because they think it's cool oh well you know it's not about perfection it's not about being um What's the word I'm trying to look for? <clears throat> it's not about perfection. It's not about 100% professional. Because I work from home. I'm a stay-at-home. Well, I used to be a stay-at-home dad. Now I'm a work-from-home dad. And for me, it's about letting people know who I am. A lot of people tell me, well, I'm camera shy. Well, pretend that you work for Nike. And just do it. Because that's the way I got comfortable. I'm... Okay... A lot of people look at the screen. Uh, if I were to look at my screen, I have my screen right. Uh, my computer has two monitors, my desktop. So all my, my work stuff goes here, my preview stuff goes here. So right now I move the video over to this screen. And, you know, I am 100% comfortable talking to you right now. And I used to be camera shy. It was crazy because I could get up, because, well, a lot of people don't know this, but I used to sing bass. I could get up in front of 2,000, 5,000, 10,000 people and sing with no problems whatsoever. But looking at a picture of myself, I mean, I have my picture on the screen, but most times I'm looking right in the camera. You know, and looking at myself or looking in the camera used to be impossible for me. But it's just, I know that there are other people on the other side of that camera, whether it's right now, uh, a week later, a month later, two years later, if you're watching this on YouTube or whatnot, there's a real person on the other side of that camera. And I don't have a, a problem talking to real people. You know, whatever it takes, if video marketing is what you need to do, then get comfortable with it. You know, make it happen. Do what it takes. And I can't say that enough. Do what it takes. Whatever it takes. Um, for those who are interested, who need a reminder, and who are willing to do whatever it takes, I want you to do this right now. Uh, you can pause this video in a minute, whatever. I want you to go find a piece of cardboard, 
uh, construction paper, colored, pla it doesn't even have to be colored, pla something that you can write on and that you can fold and it will keep its shape. Because I want you to take, let me look at my desk here, see if I've got something handy. I know I've got some construction paper upstairs, where the kids do at least, but, uh, well, I'll just take a piece of paper, but you can imagine it's card, oh, this is awesome, I'm not going to fold that. My wife did this for me, she printed it out for me, she goes, I love you more than the internet. That's a lot, that was awesome, that's why I kept that. But, let's see, uh, any, okay, here's a piece of paper that has... Okay, so this is some of my accounting stuff that I don't need anymore because it was from last month. I digitize everything. So, imagine this is a piece of cardboard. I want you to take it. I want you to fold it in half. I'm going to try to get it halfway straight so it at least stands up on its own. But the purpose is you're going to want to stand this up on its own. If you have to, to add something else to make it stand up, whatnot, cool. Um, marker. Oh, that's a dry erase. That won't work. Okay, I want you to use a marker, but I'm going to use a pen just for example. And I want you to write two lines on it. On the top, I want you to write, if it is to be, like this. I don't know if you can see that. If it is to be, it is up to me. Now whatever it takes you can write it better you know you can print it out if you want to do that on cardstock. Oh yeah I could have used cardstock I have some. <laughs> but I want you to write this on a piece of paper however big however small whatever it takes so that you see it and that you see it every day and I want you to put it right in front of your monitor. I want you to put it right there. If it is to be it is up to me. Read it every day. Look at it constantly. Remind yourself, do whatever it takes because no one is going to be able to change your situation for you. Nobody. And, you know, like that girl Amanda, I want to be able to change her situation. So I can go pay for internet for her. I can go buy her a laptop. But what she does with it, that's up to her because what if she turns around and sells that laptop for extra cash? You know, she might do that. And if she does, well, I'm sorry. You know, if, if, if I try to help somebody and they, and they do something like that, I just don't help them again. And, you know, you, I'm not saying be mean. I'm, I'm definitely not saying be mean. Be willing to help other people. But be willing to know when to say enough is enough. Because if they're not going to help themselves, there is nothing you can do about it. There is nothing else you can do to help them. <clears throat> Sorry, my allergies. You know, it's kind of like it's kind of like a drug addict. People get so used, they get addicted to being poor. Call me crazy, but I, they get addicted to being poor. It's comfortable. It's what they know, and people are afraid to change. Get yourself out of yourself. Don't limit. Don't limit yourself. Do whatever it takes. If it's uncomfortable, do it anyway. Because you will get comfortable with it. I promise you. Just like these videos. I'm comfortable with it. I actually <laughs> I actually enjoy doing this. I enjoy sitting here 8-10 hours a day. Sometimes I can't sit that long. Sometimes I can't do that because of kids in school or homework. They need help or going to the grocery store. What? It doesn't matter. I enjoy doing this. And you can enjoy doing it too. And that's when you really start making money is when you start enjoying it. When it becomes something positive in your head. If you sit down in this and you say, God, I have to promote again. Dang it. Well, let me see if I can find somebody's ad and copy this and piece that together and put my link in there. And God, I hate to do that. Okay. If you do that, you are not going to make any money and the reason is because people know it comes across in your ad it comes across in your conversation it comes across in your ex in your uh, 
inflection, your voice, and your, your facial expressions. They know when you don't enjoy it. They know when you enjoy it. I mean, that's... You can't do anything about that. Even if it's just text that you're, you're, you're putting an ad together to put in Facebook groups or on Google Plus or Craigslist. If you mess with Craigslist, I don't. Um, you know, back page, free classified sites, uh, forums, uh, safe list, whatever, you, whatever it is that you do, however it is that you market because there's so many free methods out there. You know, whatever, is it, whatever it is that you do, wherever you post, they can tell if you're having fun or not. And if you're not having fun and you're not making money, then how can you expect anyone else to join you? Right? Now, I'm not saying you have to make money first, but have fun with it. Because that's how you're going to make money. Because I have fun with it. And that's what really changed it for me. That's what really made it take off. And especially the videos. You know, I was just telling somebody tonight. I said, well, I'm camera shy. I can't do that. Let me tell you something. Whether you say you can or if you say you can't, you are exactly right. Because it's what you decide to do that will make it happen. And this camera that, that I'm, this camera I'm using now, yeah, I had another camera. In, well, I have one on my laptop here. Not great quality. But, you know, I found this, the camera that I'm using right now on Amazon.com. It's an HD 720p uh, tie def camera for seven bucks, and okay, after shipping, it was like nine dollars and change. So under ten bucks, and I got an HD camera. That's awesome. You know, why did I do that? Was it's not because my video quality was suffering because the other camera wasn't as good. Because people don't care about your video quality. They care about you. They care about if you're going to lead them. They care about whether or not you're going to help them. So be the person, be the sponsor that you want to be. Be the sponsor, no, let me rephrase that. Be the, sp be the sponsor that you want to have. Spend some personal time with your people. Spend some personal training time. There's people in the group like uh, this lady that I was uh, helping with just a little earlier. She was having problems with, with oh, well, I'm not going to put any specifics out there because I don't want to you know, make anyone uncomfortable, but uh, she was having some problems, so... I did TeamViewer with her, which is a like a remote control software, or I can control her computer and see what she sees, and you know she can show me what's going on, and you know I don't charge anything for that. It's a free download. It's free software. I don't charge anything for my time. I offered to help, you know, and people want those kind of people. So be the person that you want. Be the person that other people are going to want to be signing up under and working with. And if you do, I guarantee you, you are going to see a change that you will not believe. And the, the positivity. Stop feeding negative into your mind. Stop. I don't even watch TV. I don't even go through my Facebook news feed because everyone's bleh, 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 bleh. Complain, 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 gripe, gripe, bitch, moan, complain. What good is it doing them? It doesn't do me any good at all. And I'm, I know it's not doing them any good because they're just concentrating on the negativity. Now, what you put in is going to start changing what's inside and it's going to start changing what comes out. It's coming out of your mouth, coming out of your typing, out of your thoughts. It's true. Cut out the negativity. Concentrate on positive things. Like I said, I don't even watch TV. I mean... Half of that's the reason that we have four TVs and every single one of them is being used all day long with video games. But, you know, when it's time... When it's time to change your life, you're going to change it. And if I can help, let me know. Because I'm willing to help. And I'm, there's nothing for me to gain from it besides seeing you succeed. Not just in your business, but in your personal life as well. Relationships, thought processes... So, I'm going to wrap it up here because I've been over a lot of stuff, but my main point that I wanted to leave with you guys was cutting out the, the negativity. If you have to cut off your mom, your dad, your mother, your brother, your sister, it, whatever, <clears throat> do what you got to do. Do what it takes. Make the change. Make it happen. Do whatever it takes. Because nobody's going to do it for you. 
and nine times out of ten nobody's even interested in seeing you succeed because they want to keep you right at the same place that they're at now if you have to cut them off so that you can succeed and then you can go back once you succeeded and try to pull them up with you that's different go for it I, as a matter of fact I beg you use use what you get use the extra that you get to go try to bring other people up to help other people because there's a lot of things in this world a lot of people say when I die I want to leave a legacy I want I want people to miss me well, let me tell you what when I die you can take throw my body in the dumpster for all I care because it doesn't matter to me this body is not going to be what's what's left behind it's this body is not what's going to be important this is just something temporary and the people that are close to me I want them to celebrate when I'm gone I want them to celebrate the life that I lived and if that's helping other people that's what I want people to know me for someone who's gonna be there for them someone who's gonna who's constantly trying to help other people sometimes you have to concentrate on your own self your own your own mindset your own business to help other people because if you can't get further up if you can't make any progress and succeed you can never help anybody else succeed and that's just all there is to it so I'm gonna leave you with that and I hope you guys have a wonderful day have a great night and I'm sorry this video most of my videos are a lot shorter I'm sorry this one is so long but you know I'm glad it happened and uh, <clears throat> so I guess the whole purpose of my video was the negativity but I'm gonna go ahead and add this in if you want to join me in working from home if you want the free bonuses that my that I provide for my team that that come out of my pocket and my work uh, you know there's a link right below this video click that link put in your name and your email address because I don't give out my information to people that aren't interested and unfortunately lately I've had to cut off uh, people that because a lot of times people will come to me and ask for help that aren't even in any of my the businesses that I'm in uh, if if that's what you're trying to do I'm sorry I can't help you but if you'd like to join me working from home and you'd like those free bonuses click the link below and your name and email address and on the page that it takes you to if you go all the way to the bottom of that page there's my picture my name my email my phone number and my Skype so you can always get a hold of me uh, the phone number that's in there it rings my house phone it rings my cell phone and it rings my wife's cell phone and if it's not one of the three of us or if it's not one of us answering then one of the kids will answer it just ask for Daniel they all know that it's a my home number is for business too so if you need to get a hold of me uh, my emails there too uh, if not, you can go to instantpaydaynetwork.us. Uh, now, I am not Instant Payday Network, okay? That is just a site that I use because, you know, search rankings, Instant Payday Network, you can't get any closer than that. Jeff's site is instantpaydaynetwork.com. Mine is instantpaydaynetwork.us. So if you need any other contact information, if you try, you know, email emailing me and I'm not at the computer, if you tried calling but um, your phone is disconnected or... I don't know, whatever the case may be, if you need another way to get a hold of me, go to instantpaydaynetwork.us and click on contact. I'm here for you. I'm here to help you get set up. I'm here to, to, to help you get started making money. And Instant Payday Network is one that I promote a lot because it's free. You don't spend any money and you can start making money. So then you can start using that money and putting it into other businesses and making long-term residual income. When I say residual, I'm talking about <coughs> every month. Now, <clears throat> I'm sorry guys, like I said, been sick with the allergies and the sore throat. I've been living off cough drops lately. But you can take that money and go into other programs like Empower Network. Uh, Empower Network, they do charge every month, but you have an opportunity there to build a residual income. And, oh, that's what I was saying. As When I talk about residual income, what I'm talking about is when somebody signs up under you, you make the commission for that person but it's not just one time it's every single month that you make that commission so if I sign up one person I get a minimum of twenty five dollars a month if I sign up five people I, yeah five people I get a minimum 
or not a minimum, but I get $125 every month, not just one time. If I sign up 100 people, $2,500 a month every month. Okay, and that's just at the very basic level. Now, if they go with Inner Circle, that's 100 extra dollars per person per month. If they upgrade past that to these other to the other products that Empower Network has, it's a one-time purchase. If it's a thousand dollars, you just made a thousand dollars because somebody that signed up under you bought that one item. And yes, it's a one-time uh, one-time commission because it's a one-time purchase for that product. But then you can go with Infinity Downline or something like that. Freebie Money Printer, uh, which is another one that's real similar to Instant Payday Network. As a matter of fact, they use the the uh, the same freebie sites that Instant Payday Network uses. But that's not my point. My point is. You can build a residual income, build the lifestyle that you want, build the lifestyle for your family that you want. Because as many kids as I have, I want to be able to put $10 million in a mutual fund that they can never touch their entire life. Some people ask me, why do you want to do that? Well, $10 million in a mutual fund, as a matter of fact, I'm going to pull up the calculator so I can, so I can do this right now. Because I'm going to show you, I don't remember the figures, but let's say... $10 million at 4% per year. That's $400,000 in interest, or not interest, but profit every year. $400,000. Now, 10 children. If I put in my will that I want it to be split equally among all of them, you divide that by 10, that's $40,000 a year each. Now, say I make lots and lots of money and I do a hundred million at four percent, which is a it's a medium risk mutual fund. It's they're they're really safe, uh, aside from what a lot of people think. So that's going to be four million dollars a year. Divide that up. Divide that up between ten kids, four hundred thousand dollars a year. How would you like to give your kids even forty thousand dollars a year for the rest of their life? I mean, it, it's it's a monthly payment they get. They would never have to worry. But better yet, if you give that entrepreneurial mindset, if you have that success mindset and you have the do-whatever-it-takes mindset, you're teaching your children to do the same. And they can do it for their kids and their kids and their family, their wife's kids, their, their sister, whatever. I mean, this... Oh my god, the possibilities are endless and it makes me dizzy sometimes thinking of it. Anyway, click the link below, get started, start doing it today, do whatever it takes. And if that means clicking that link below, do it right now. And just so you know, I love all you guys. Take care, have a great day. no time to lose, gotta show what we all about. Don't know about you, but I know about me and boy, I got